Hi, I'm Junior Tingles from ASMR Family, and today I'm going to be doing a bath bomb video, and if you've never saw these before, they can get crazy. So, our first bath bombs that we have are, are um, airhead bath bombs, and there's different kind of flake, like scents they smell, and it's there's watermelon, blue raspberry, and straw... We have no water in the bowls. All right, so let's start putting in the um, airhead bath bombs into the water. So first, let's put first let's put. Uh, I think that this is either strawberry or watermelon. It's strawberry because it smells like strawberry, and they have scents. All right, so let's put it into the first bowl. Oh, shoot, I think that they're going to overflow, maybe. Oh, this should be on our ASMR videos. It sounds very violent. Alright. Well, there's like steam coming off, which is really cool. I think that it's starting to calm down a little bit. And also at the end of like all these bath bombs, I'm going to um, to like vote on which one was the best, and then we're going to get a new bath bomb. I'm gonna put in um, blue raspberry next. Ew! One of those just popped into my mouth. Ew. What's wrong with it? Right, so. This one smells like blue raspberry, of course. All right, so we're going to put the blue one in the middle bowl. He sounds so cool. And also, if you're in the bath, it'll, like, color your water, like, all different kinds of colors. It's really cool. They sound so cool. Now this looks like someone died in there or something, like blood water. Just do this on Halloween and then just set it outside something. It'll be amazing. Uh. Ew, another one popped into my mouth. Okay, I'm not doing that again. Mm. Alright, so next we have um, watermelon. So, we're going to start doing watermelon while this one keeps on doing its crazy thingy. This smells like soap. I don't know though. This is double relaxing. They are really cool. I don't know which color I like better because these two are my favorite colors. I feel like these have a darker tan than this one, especially the blue. Mm. I vote this one. I think that this is the best. So we're going to keep this one, and then these two are going to be gone for this next round. All right, so let's go on to the next round. All right, this is round two. So on this side, we have this is made by the company Spa Naturals, and it is the bath bomb vanilla and coconut. And also, over here, we have um, another uh, coconut cream and vanilla going against this one. And it's by Bolero. And so, we're going to put them in against each other. And we're going to see which one, like, fizzes over the most. Like, I don't know. Because we're doing two against two because this one only has two. So, we're going to start. Right. I'm going to go ahead and get them both out and put them in at the same time. All right, so three. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I almost forgot to sniff them. Who cannot, who can do that? Me, apparently. These smell so good. 
These these do smell like vanilla and coconut actually. They do smell really good. They they kind of smell like a spa. Well, it's made by a spa, so that's probably why. All right, so three, two, one. They don't color your water, cause well, probably cause they're white. I don't know. But now we're going to be trying the coconut cream and vanilla bath bomb. Alright, so, I'll sniff them. Some, some of the dust went up my nose. Okay, well, these smell the same. Okay, well, well, they kind of feel like smell like vanilla a little bit, but I don't know. Let's just. Whoa, that looks like sand now. Actually, that's really cool. All right, so let's put these in and see what they look like. Whoa, that one's like shedding like a dog. I think that they're dogs. Is shedding. This one gives the bath a little bit more color because it kind of gives it like a sandy kind of color. But this one foams a little bit more. So I don't know. It's going to be a hard decision. But I don't know. Let's do the stainage test. It puts a little bit of foam on your hands, but it's not that bad. They don't stain you. Probably because they're white. I don't think white ones would really stain you. Um... I think that these are better because it gives you a little bit more color. So I'm voting these. All right, so these are going to stay for the next round and then we're going to go on to round three. See you then. All right, so this is round three and this one's name is Treat Me. Who would name their bath bomb Treat Me? That's just weird. but. I found this when I was at the Dollar Tree today, and I think that's really good for the Dollar Tree, but the last ones, um, Vanilla and Coconut, did not really fizz, so I feel like this one might not, like, fizz that much, but, um, this one looks like a cupcake. I think it's really cute for the Dollar Tree, and it's just really messy. It's getting all over the table, and... It looks really good, and, um, just kidding. <laughs> it smells like a residence home for some reason. It just reminds me of that. I don't know why, but... A nursing home? It A nursing home, which is weird. Ew. It smells like one of those bathrooms, that one. Alright, well... <laughs> So we're going to put this in and see how much it fizzes for a Dollar Tree bath bomb. Because the other ones still have not fizzed. And let's see. Oh, and this one has sparkles too. It's a foamy. I can tell that. I mean, is it rising? We might have a trouble. Oh, and also I just thought that um, we don't have nothing to compare this one. So basically this one's going on to the finals. It is foaming up crazy. Hopefully this one does not overflow, but it has a while to go before it overflows. This is a really messy one. I think that this might actually be our most foamiest bath bomb. Too bad we don't have a ward to like foamiest bath bomb. 
but it's getting higher as we speak. I've never seen a bath bomb that fizzes like this much. Like it, it's like little bubbles too. It's really cool. I like the color. It looks like I don't know how to describe, like a spa day kind of, like I don't know, or like nail polish remover. <laughs> It's kind of like that kind of like tannish pink, but this one's basically moving on to the next round because it's the only one. I mean, not next round, the um, the final reveal of which ones all went through. All right, well, I'm going to show you which ones all went through. Hopefully, this one is just not like overflow while we're showing you all the other ones. But here was the first round, the Airheads one. I really like this one because it's like the one that only has like a dark kind of like color. And um, it wasn't really too crazy. But I really liked the smell. It was um, blue raspberry. And it's going to overflow, I feel like. I feel like I just need to sit sit down and stare at it forever. All right. And then the um, second round was the other Dollar Tree one. The bath bomb has still not fizzed down. That shows you how bad Dollar Tree brand bath bombs are, but this one's a really good one. So treat me one treat me brand is a really good brand to get if you find it at the dollar tree but that has just still not fizzed down um i um these well they all kind of have like a color but let's see if any of these like stain my hands sounds so cool. Okay, it makes you really foamy, but let me wash it off and see if it did stain me. It makes your hand like sandy. I don't... I do not like the texture. I would not like to be sitting in the bath on like a sandy beach. It's like a purple sandy beach in one little bowl. I've never seen that. But it is really foamy. Ew, I, I, ew, I still don't like the feel. Ew. All right, now let's just wash it off with some blue raspberry. It feels really good. This one's like just water now. Like if someone got some food dye and just in some water and put some scent of blue raspberry in it. I really like the feel of that one. I'm not even going to talk about that one. It's just, this should be eliminated completely. Um, which one should finally win? I don't know, it's a tough decision. Wow, it's a tough decision between these two. Um, I think that I like this one a little bit more because it was just one dollar and it fizzed up this much. But I don't know, this came with one and then these came with three. So. I think that the blue one, because it's one of my favorite colors, and it smells really good. But the only thing I don't like about it is it doesn't really foam. I like, like, the crazy ones, kind of. And this was a crazy one, but I, I still like this one. So, yeah. This one was the final winner. And I'll make another bath bomb video whenever I fill up my stash with bath bombs again. 
and then we'll see which ones win the next time. All right, I'll see you later.